Hey there, it's Tiny Pretty Pretty Sugar Co. and I'm here to do my January kit lineup. This is like the fourth time I've started this video, but I keep getting so tongue-tied that it, I don't get it right. And it's like, it's not cute. It's one of those like tongue-tied where it's like, are, are you good? And yes, I am. But Kevin and I went and had a date today and I was being so extra and I'm just, I need to film this, but I'm in such a good mood that I feel like I'm kind of like, kind of like vibrating. So I'm having a hard time sitting still and talking through this. But anyway, I needed to film this so I can do this plan with me in a day or two. So um, this is the week of our anniversary and New Year's, which is kind of a bummer, except that I love that January 1st is a Monday, so I don't even care. So we're going to blow through New Year's kit and go into my anniversary, which is the 7th. The plan is still tentatively to go to the beach for the weekend, but Kevin starts his new job one of these two days, the 4th or the 5th, something like that. So he may be tuckered um, and not want to go. So instead of doing the beach Molly Christmas kit, because technically this is still in the 12 days of Christmas, I decided to go with this old Simply Gilded kit. So Kevin and I anniversary, or anniversary, I did that in the last like 500 times I said it. We honeymooned in Fredericksburg and it was during like peach season. So we kept seeing these signs for peaches. So every anniversary, now you can see where I got that from. I try to use something that's peach colored or themed to a trip we're doing or something like this. But this year we're going full peach. So it's called Hello Darling, which I assume is some flower, but... I am not well versed in um, flower knowledge. And then you have icons and these are really cool. It's like they're hearts, but they're the date numbers over the big print and then some more icons. Then we have the add-on sheet, which I believe gives you nine boxes in total, which is cool. And then the bow seals, which you guys know I love bow seals. So that's pretty exciting. This unfortunately is a kit that I feel like I'm going to need to pull in a bunch of boxes, which it's been a minute since I planned with the Simply Gilded one, and I, I feel like I forgot a little bit of some of the, like, more goofy parts of her kit. I definitely like the new layout, but I feel like I have plenty of leftovers to get this to work, and I think it'll be so cute, plus it's all peachy and stuff. The washi that I chose actually is what came with the sub kit, and it is these two. It's this little pretty 5 millimeter bow. Hi! I'm having a hard time filming because I'm still excited about the date we went on today. It was a good date. It was a good date. And then we ate egg salad, which could, it could have been better. It was good. It was fine. Um, H-E-B has all our items in stock, so whenever we decide we can go, we can go. See, I gotta fix my clothes. Whatever. I love you. So I picked out the washi that actually went with the kit because it was easy and thank you past Tanya for putting it on the back so I even remembered this because this is probably a two year old kit or better but I think it'll be really cute and it'll be a nice break from all the wintery stuff. I say that like I don't love winter spreads but I do. Next up is this week. It's the 8th through the 14th. Nothing exciting is happening but I've had the Sweet Kawhi design kit forever. Like it's still on the 3M paper and I love a neutral January. Like I just I'm here for it. Like February is my more fun winter kits but man I love like just a neutral January so I decided let's go ahead and try to use this kit like I said it's pretty old so it's time to get out of the collection and it's cute like it's really cute bottom washi date covers I really like those and then you can see the color palette and all the checklists and stuff and I kind of went kind of weird with the washi so I don't know about this I'm not sold but that's not right let's get you the full boxes but this like neutral washi section is really cute. I'm like, you know, I'm gonna be playing with my planner. So why wouldn't I do that? And then I also, in case I wasn't feeling that thought, if, you know, it's gonna be one or the other. I mean, or both, I could do what I want. It's my planner, but I don't know. I feel like I kind of just wanna do this. It's cutesy. I never use it. I mean, look at this. So maybe we'll see. But this one I feel like could change, but I've been changing this one out for years at this point. I need to just go ahead and use it. Plus, I just know this is going to be like the cutest spread when it's all done. Oh, okay. I think I'm just going to commit to it. All right, we'll go. all right, next up is the 15th through the 21st. This one I'm really excited about. This is a kit that I have been, I don't know, maybe last year I got it. I don't even know if this was exclusive art or not, but I just, I love it. I love it. It's so pretty. The colors, oh, the colors are so good. And look at the little feetsies. Um, and I think I have enough boxes to leave the girls out. Let's see. One. Yeah. I mean, I'm not a big fan of disembodied body parts, but I feel like it's better than having, like, the back of someone's head, someone taking a selfie, and then her with her breasticles out. Which, I mean, okay, you do you, but 
I think I'm going to be happy leaving those out. And plus those are cute socks and I love the colors. I decided to go with, oh, apparently I also bought the add-on. So good for me. I decided that I wanted to use what was left of this silver foil bundle, which is, it's not a lot. It's uh, six, what was I thinking? <laughs> six boxes and then two sets of headers. And then I don't know. I don't know whatever and then I have this washi which is this like cool I don't know tweedish kind of I don't know tweed adjacent we'll call it tweed but I think it'll look really pretty with the full boxes and I really like it plus that gives me like I can put that here with the bow, I just think it'll be nice. I was thinking maybe I should do, do like a full bougie spread, but I just can't commit to that. So I think I'm gonna let it ride and hopefully maybe we can find some more uh, foil to go with, where, where is my miscellaneous foil? Okay, here, let's see. We need a silver full box, which I don't think I have a lot of silver full boxes. Um, I mean, those are kind of cute. That'd be cute. They could fill in nicely. And then, then I have some underlays. These are just like my random stuff that doesn't have a home. Yeah. Why don't we do that? That'll work. Then we'll get to use this cute little caress, caress freebie, which I think it'll, it'll look nice with all the, oh my gosh, it's stuck to my finger. I think it'll look nice with all the, yeah, that's cute. Really, really cute. It's cold AF. That's funny. Drink hot cocoa. Y'all, Kevin and I got really, really drunk one night in college while I was still in college um, on spiked hot cocoa and I still, I can't drink it. I can't drink hot cocoa still. Oh, it's a bummer, but I like hot cider. So that's pretty cool. And then last but not least, this is a cute printable kit. I don't think this is exclusive art because I don't think she does exclusive art, but this is, I just, I'm obsessed. I love it. It's from Plank Planner Shop, so you can hippity hop on over and grab it yourself. And then it's an instant download and print and cut. Chef's Kiss. This one is just, I'm so excited to use this one. And you got extra boxes. I printed everything. Like, everything. Oh, I love it. It's so good. And I kind of went off base, which not for me, because you guys know I love this wood grain, but I feel like this rose gold looks so good with the wood colors. Like it's just, it's good. So then I pulled out an older, maybe not, not super old. This is Scribble Prince Co. I don't know. I don't know the names of her stuff. Definitely her rose gold because it's kind of pinky, but it's like a confetti. But I feel like it's going to look really, really pretty. And I somehow managed to get the underlays. I'm sure I bought it that way or it was a grab or something. Um, I just feel like this could be really, really cute. So my thought was we would do full bougie. Like this is going to be like a 45 minute plan along um, with probably no plans, mind you. And yeah, I think it'll be cute. I'm thinking wood grain washi. And then I was thinking I would do one of the half cuts here with the bow on top or I could put the wood grain at the tippity top with the date covers you know what we're just gonna see it's like four weeks away so I'm sure that'll come around that we'll we'll get it sorted anyway that is it this was a much shorter video than I thought but I'm really excited and I'm really excited to use this for my anniversary I feel like this is for sure the one that's not gonna change and then this one's probably not. And then the other two, as much as I like them, it really could go either way. Because I have a whole mess of winter kits that I don't have space for. And, like, sometimes I just flip through them to look at my stash, right? I don't know if anybody else does that. See if anything else tickles me to use. And then sometimes I'm running my business and something, you know, pops down. And it's like, it's time. It's time to use this. But I really need to um, curb the winter kits. I just... I love them so much. So anyway, thank you so much for stopping by. I would love if you gave this video a thumbs up. If you decide to come join the Itty Bitty Spirit Family, that would be incredible. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.